Now, I wish I could really start this episode off by singing a Thanksgiving Day song, but I don't I don't know any. Do you? I don't think they are. I, I can't think of one. Are there any Thanksgiving songs? Happy Turkey Day to yeah, you. Yeah, I'm sure there's something out there. <laughs> well, uh, I, I know what I'm doing later, uh, but but what people are going to see, let's, let's tell them a little bit about it, Kelly. What's coming up on today's voting broadcast? Yes, welcome everybody and uh, welcome and enjoy your holiday season here. Uh, today we have an ep- excellent episode, an episode excellent uh, of voting <laughs> broadcast, and we're going to be talking uh, new safety gear for boaters, uh, an immersive experience in galleon yachts, which is pretty cool. And a holiday gift guide for the water lovers out there, which is pretty much everybody that's watching this uh, episode right now. We're also going to have a C-Ray, uh, a special guest from C-Ray, uh, Caroline English, who's the C-Ray Marketing Director. She's going to be talking about the new C-Ray Seas and Greetings. Uh, there's a holiday gift guide and some really cool social things that Ooh. are taking place at C-Ray for, uh, C-Ray for the holidays. And uh, Lannon's going to be talking to us about some additional ways that people can maybe help out the environment while also being out on the water. So you got to stay Awesome. Safe. Welcome to From the Helm Boating Broadcast with Marine Max, bringing you the latest news and notes in the world of boats. That is awesome. Well, thank you so much, everybody, for joining us. Welcome to From the Helm Boating Broadcast. Yes. We are your hosts. I am Lisa, and that guy over there is Kelly. Hello. Interact with us in comments, and and please share this out with your friends and family. This is going to be a fun episode because we are bringing you a ton of holiday gift ideas. Yes. Um, Kelly did mention that there is an immersive experience with Galleon. You know what? We move that to next week. So okay. you guys are going to have to turn tune in to, to see a little bit more about what that means. Uh, but right now, let's dive in mm-hmm. to gift ideas. Gift ideas. Um, this, this first article here is from Yachting Magazine. And it specifically talks about new safety gear for boaters. And Kelly, I know our team's been talking about this. We've got a ton of new boaters on the water Mm -hmm. and we wanna make sure that everyone knows what they need to be safe. So this this, uh, article, it talks about binoculars, which is Mm -hmm. not something that we typically think about when boating, Um, life jackets and, and personal locator beacons. So really cool stuff here. Yeah, you make a good point too. I mean, there's a lot of new boaters out there, people that wouldn't typically be boating. You know, everybody wants to be out on the water these days, especially uh, during uh, the socially distanced. Uh, just it's a great opportunity to just get outside and, and enjoy uh, the outdoors. But you have to also keep that into consideration that there's a lot of people that are new to it. So mm-hmm. think of like a ice skating rink when you're out there doing your tricks and there's somebody that's kind of, you know, like that a little bit. Uh, there's just <laughs> always kind of that, that room for uh, learning a little bit. So um, opportunities to keep people safe out on the water are always a good thing. So having some of these uh, items uh, as in the in this gift guide here is always a good thing. Uh, excellent. Yes. And uh, we always celebrate National Safe Boating Week, which is usually in May. Mm-hmm. And the goal of that is to encourage all new boaters to be more responsible on the water, wear a life jacket. Um, the, the event is usually in the spring, right before the summer boating season uh, takes place in most of the country. And it's a great time to take inventory of the gear that can help keep everyone safe in an emergencies or to help avoid emergencies altogether. Uh, so when you think about the holidays, you know, back that up a couple, you know, you got spring, you got summer boating season, you got to prepare in the spring. Hey, time to buy new gear in December. For sure. So there's some cool stuff here from, from Yachting Magazine. Um, I do have to say one thing, you know, being, you know, a guy thing is always, oh, I don't want to be wearing that. I don't want to be doing that. You know, uh, especially with life jackets, there's always yeah. those people out there like, I don't need a life jacket, that kind of thing. And I think one way that you could totally sell people on a life vest or a, you know, PFD is just making it cool, right? I mean, yeah. just having like a that cool one, one right there, like this one right here, the Spinlock Deck Vest 60 Life Jacket. That's a pretty sweet name, have to say. <laughs> um, you know, it's just a great way to, to get people to wear it. But also, I think that this one has to be extremely uh, capable um, in, in getting you out there, uh, being safe, but also probably mm-hmm. being very, um, like you don't even feel like it's on most of the time, right. which is a big, a big benefit for these life vests. Yeah. That's an excellent gift. You're a good point because you, you know, when you buy a boat from Marine Max, you automatically get life jackets, but they're mm-hmm. not the, 
you know, they're, they're your standard PFDs. Sure. Sure. Uh, that one looks like you're coming, you know, from out of space or something. It's pretty neat. <laughs> like you're jumping out of an airplane or something. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> and it's always good to have a, a pair of binoculars too. I mean, you never know when you're going to need that. Seeing something off yeah. in the distance, if there might be a boat in distress, you could kind of get a little bit more about their, their situation mm -hmm. and if you need to hop on the, on the radio and, and get additional assistance. Always good uh, to have that uh, on board. Yeah. And another good gift that you can spend a little bit of money on, because how often do you buy binoculars, right? You might as well get like a high quality, yes. nice pair of binoculars. Again, a really good gift because it's not really something you think about buying yourself. No. And it, like you said, it's something that, you know, you probably want to keep the rest of your life probably too. Yeah, and, uh, if exactly. you get a, a nice quality pair as opposed to just a, you know, a crummy one off Amazon or something for three ninety nine, uh, you probably... It's probably not going to work too well when you want it to. So always having right. a nice pair like those, these Bushnell Forge lines, uh, the, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> those are pretty awesome. All right. Let's take a turn uh, and get into one of Kelly's favorite subjects, fishing. Fishing. Uh, this next article is from Sport Fishing Magazine. It's their holiday fishing guide for 2020. Yep. They have a ton of stuff listed in this article um, it, everything from tackle gear and idea, ideas from your favorite brands and, and price range, everything from $50 all the way up to a few hundred bucks. So mm -hmm. it, it spans the gamut on things you can buy for that, that fishing lover in your family. Already. I'm seeing this first one here, this tackle box, which one, th one thing that you want in a good tackle box, especially if you're being kind of more portable is you don't want it to be this huge thing. You know, there's, there's right. always these tackle boxes that are the size of a big, you know, cardboard box and you're lugging <laughs> it around with you. But a lot of times you just want it like, you know, in a, a little backpack or something that you can bring with you. This one looks like it kind of slides in. You could probably put 10 of these right next to each other and it'd only be about this big. So mm -hmm. always good to have for a tackle box is just to, keep it compact. And, uh, obviously the lures are always usually pretty thin, pretty, uh, you know, small. So let's do the same thing with tackle here too. Right. So that thing is, pretty that's cool. a good point. All right. What do we got next? Calcutta. One of my dad's favorite brands. He always, yeah. loved Calcutta. I think the logo always gets people with that ballyhoo and the, the, <laughs> the skull's mouth, but, yeah. but Hey, a like, good waterproof duffel. That's, that's always yep. good to have too. Right. Yep. Uh, e even like if you want to go on the smaller side, a dry bag, Something yep. a lot of people don't have, or they use like a you know, Ziploc bag. Mm -hmm. They make some really cool, very durable dry bags that are great gift ideas. You ever go uh, like in the BVI when you swim to the baths, you have yeah. to your, you get your little dry bag and you just put it on your back and, and something like this uh, waterproof duff will probably be pretty good for that too. Absolutely. Kind of. Ooh. Ooh. Performance shirts. <laughs> These are pretty awesome. You, you, you can never uh, have enough uh, just good breathable shirts for being out on the water or just basically living in Florida. It's now, what, what was that brand? Blue water? Blue fin Blue USA. Fin. Never all right, all right. heard of it, but love the logo. It's a cool. Hey, recommended on. by sport fishing magazine. It's gotta be a pretty good brand. Yeah. I am myself. Uh, I, I like a uh, Columbia. I tend yeah. to lean towards a lot of the Columbia stuff. I like their, their, their stuff, especially this kind of shirt. They always mm -hmm. make, you know, they got it down to a science at this point with those. Yeah, shirts. Absolutely. All right, let's look at a couple more things. And you always we can... need a good pair of shorts, right? Yep. Uh, being out on the water, if you're if you're even on a boat, you know, and you're backing down on a 500-pound a marlin, it's going to be splashing you, and you don't want to be wearing, like, jeans. So right. there you go. You got a nice <laughs> pair. Uh, Pelagic makes some really good fishing stuff. Uh, again, my, one of my dad's favorites is the Pelagic, Pelagic brand. Nice. I want a hat and some socks at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show. Ah. I won, I won like a raffle and I got some, some nice uh, gear from them. They do have nice product. Yeah. This is pretty sweet too. I mean, it's a waterproof uh, jacket that, I mean, I could just picture somebody up in like, you know, maybe the Northeast or something like that out on, in some high swells wearing something yeah. like this and just getting drenched from head to toe, but still being <laughs> dry underneath. Um, but that's a pretty cool jacket there. That is a pretty cool jacket. And I mean, here you go. This is uh, from Accurate. I think they, they also make uh, reels, uh, some really high-end reels for fishermen. Um, but also, that it looks like they make these cool pliers, which um, if those things, I, I believe they're going to be titanium. I think most of their reels are titanium. But, I mean, that's one thing you do not want to skimp on. And I'm having that issue right now that I bought a pair, which I shouldn't have done, for too cheap. And oh. you're trying to cut the fishing line, and it doesn't even cut fishing line. You know you got a problem. So... A really yeah. good pair of pliers always on you at any point. You know, you can use it to pull a hook out or 
or mm-hmm. cut something or cut a line. So especially from Accurate, which is a great brand. Um, right. You heard right. it here first. If you know Kelly Berry, he needs some new, <laughs> new uh, high-end pliers. Yes. Oh, and uh, these are <laughs> aluminum. So um, yeah, okay. think, think of how light those are going to be if they're aluminum. That'll be pretty awesome. All right. Look at those sweet fillet knives. Man, yeah. I could go on all day about this, Lisa. This is- uh, I know. Now, this is a good find it's, here. It, it is a fairly lengthy article. So we we could spend, I mean, I know you want to look at everything here. And it, it's great information. Sure. And just really, there's a Columbia product. Nice little yeah. uh, dry bag. That's another good one for the BBIs, Lisa. You put a bunch yep. of, you know, you put a, a couple of uh, the Caribs in, in your, your <laughs> backpack and uh, maybe a towel or something. You're good to go for the baths for a day. That's awesome. Well, we could go on all day about this. This is a really yep. cool article here. So check it out on Sport Fishing Magazine. Uh, basically, just go to Google, type in Sport Fishing Mag um, Holiday Fishing Gift Guide, and you'll probably find it. Yep. And we'll make sure to uh, link all these articles on, on our webpage. Uh, so if you go to the Marine Max website and you search the Lifestyles uh, blog, you can find, find a link to this. So we For have sure. uh, a couple more holiday guides that we could get into. Okay. Um, Boating, Boating Magazine did... Um, this is just cool boating gifts for uh, the, oh, it's actually 2019 holiday season is, is the title of it. You know what? Still applicable. Still applicable. Still applicable. <laughs> yes. I mean, I don't think other than the massive pandemic going on, not much has changed between 2020 and 2019. So this is still very right. useful. Some more tech. Um, this this one covers 35 absolutely fantastic gift ideas to purchase for the nautically obsessed person in your family. Mm-hmm. Um, everything from wearables like watches and, and some apparel to coolers and bags and the latest tech gear for your boat. And of course, uh, water sports gear as well. So mm-hmm. no matter who, what kind of boating personality you have, uh, there are always more fun toys to buy. <laughs> Lisa, this is basically like all up my alley here. All this stuff pretty much. I, I for know this it is. Shirt. This is the only thing that's probably not. A, maybe it will be up my alley just because it's so ridiculous. And it has a narwhal on it. You see this at the bottom right? <laughs> Look, there's a narwhal on the the, the shirt, which is, if it, we, it is. I wish we could get Landon here and talk about narwhal. It, that is definitely a Landon shirt. <laughs> that is definitely a Landon. Okay, you heard, heard it here first. If anybody knows Landon DeGraff, yeah. buy, him, buy him the ridiculous fish shirt. There's he still was- time for that. Yeah, there's still time for the holidays to get land in this this amazing shirt here. Well, so. it's definitely a statement, and you see that with a lot of those, uh, you know, Hawaiian print shirts. It's the fish. It's the, you know, boat boat shirt. You see a lot of guys ro- rocking those. That's not your style, Kelly. No, it actually is. Now looking at, it, I mean, it's just so ridiculous <laughs> that I need to wear this. Um, the Norwal gotcha. Like I think the point of this shirt is like, um, fish you wouldn't think would be on a fishing shirt. <laughs> <laughs> They, they're on here so they did a good job it's like some sort of like european pickerel or something like that it's uh it's pretty awesome the fact that you know that <laughs> is just perfect i think i don't know you guys in the comments let me know what fish are on this shirt but <laughs> so yeah, very cool. again a ton of great gift ideas from boating magazine mm-hmm. um we could again scroll through this and talk about it all day the last one i have is of course it's from marine max this is a holiday gift guide and it breaks it out into, you know, that persona. Mm -hmm. Do you have an avid fisherman? Is it a techie? Is it a wake lover, a pet owner, sun worshiper, or a red solo cup collector? Whatever your persona is, we've given you a couple ideas to just think about with links so you can keep fishing uh, or fishing for the perfect gift. If you, you know, pun intended. Um, so great stuff here. So a lot of really good ideas. If you're struggling to find that perfect gift for uh, that boat lover or water lover in your life, we've got you covered here. Hey, and I, you're you're seeing we're talking back and down on fish. You got one right there. So that guy would totally be rocking one of those waterproof fishing uh-huh. jackets, or um, you know some of the that those uh, sweet swim uh, swim trunks or something like that. I mean, there's just so many opportunities. No matter what the fishing life or the boating lifestyle, this guy. Clearly, he could be rocking a fishing shirt or some sweet coat mm-hmm. does. And uh, yeah, so so check it out. Uh, there's just a lot of cool opportunities here to to get something neat for a, a family member to this holiday season. All right, everyone. Please welcome to the program, Caroline English, C-Ray Marketing Director, and a good friend out of Chicago. How's it going? Welcome to the program. Welcome, Hi. Caroline. Thanks so much for having me. 
<laughs> well, we appreciate you stopping by and, uh, mm-hmm. you know, welcome to the show. Uh, Thank you. How are you today? Doing well. Excited to be here. Um, my name is, yeah, Caroline English. I'm the new marketing director over at Sea Ray. So excited to um, be here today. I uh, love boating, love spending time outside. So thrilled to just be part of this amazing industry. Oh, for awesome. sure. For sure. And C-Ray, of course, you know, there's just so many amazing products coming out of there yeah. and uh, has been for so many years. It's just such a uh, a brand uh, that everybody knows. And, and anytime you see right. one on the water, people know about it. Uh, tell us a little bit about the, the C-Ray brand for those that might not know or, uh, you know, what's some of the history and, and some of the things that you guys are doing these days? We have been really in the space for close to 60 years. Um, yeah. Such an, um, you know, such an amazing brand. Uh, we have really been in this kind of luxury space for a while and um, ha- have come up with a variety of new boats. Our, mm-hmm. our SLX 400 was out recently, our entertainer, um, and that's gotten quite a great um, reaction from the public. And we're working on some exciting new product launches for next year as well. So can't say a lot about that quite yet, but um, <laughs> stay tuned, hopefully for early Q1 for some exciting new product launches from us. Awesome. awesome. And I just did bring up the uh, C-Ray website because you, right. you can't go wrong with, with this website. There's just so many beautiful images and, and right. products on here too. And, and some of the future things we're going to be talking about in this interview uh, comes from this website. So just uh, of course, let's check it out. All right. So we know that uh, you have fans. There are, there are people that are diehard C-Ray fans mm-hmm. and you guys are doing a very special thing this, this holiday season. It's called the C-Ray Seas and Greetings. Seas, as in the sea, yeah. un, a pun intended. Uh, <laughs> let's dive into this program and, and talk about how your fans can can win some cool stuff. Great. Sounds good. Yeah. So to your point, one of our favorite things in our marketing department is engaging with our community, engaging with our owners and our fans. Um, and so the intention of this season's greetings campaign is really to, to do just that in three different ways. Um, So the first one is we've shared a holiday gift guide with some ideas of things you might buy the boater in your life. Um, We're also launching a photo contest. We'd love to see pictures of our fans, you know, out on the water or just living their life. So we're asking you to submit pictures of, you know, yourself decking your sea ray and getting that ready for the holidays or, or even just enjoying the holidays with your family. Um, And then we'll also be hosting different virtual events on our Facebook page that are holiday Mm -hmm. themed and just a great way to kind of bring people together during this holiday season. Awesome. Kelly, can we take a look at that, uh, the holiday gift guide? Yeah, yeah, let's definitely, let's uh, pop that up here. I gotta see what's in here. Yeah, so this is really the first time we put together a holiday gift guide. Um, We've had a lot of fun doing that with with our partners. Um, I know you guys have covered boats in this, or boating gifts and gifts for boaters, people that love the water earlier in Mm -hmm. the episode, but if you're looking for more ideas, um, we've included some some fun ideas in here from, you know, latest boat tech from, from some of our partners over at Simrad or Fusion. Cool. Um, we have sunglasses from Maui Gym, Blue Chair Bay Rum, Yeti Coolers, just a lot of kind of fun ideas that are very much boating themed. Um, and then, of course, we couldn't put out a gift guide without recommending a Sea Ray. So we have our latest <laughs> 2021 models in here. Yeah. Um, for for the really really nice gifts that you want to give the person you you like a lot, um, so excited to have those models in 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 the um, gift guide as well. Well, I love too that uh, I mean obviously you know gift guides uh, it's more uh, about all the things that you can put in your boat too. So we're talking all things you know the the technology that you can put in the fusion, uh, you know controls for your radio, your simrad, mm-hmm. touch screens, mm-hmm. all the cool tech stuff that any any anybody would want uh, if you're a boater throughout the year. Yeah. yeah. Kenyan Grills, too. I mean, we yeah. talked to uh, the team Kenyan at Grills. Kenyan there, and uh, shout out to them. I mean, just so many cool things that you can get on your boat. And of course, you need a sweet pair of shades, right? While you're of out course. on the water. So you got to know what Exactly. Yeah, exactly. No, I love it. And it's a great way to go shopping, uh, especially for that boat lover in your life. I mean, we've had so many people join the boating community this, this past yeah. year. So now, okay, you have the boat. Now it's time to outfit it with accessories. Mm-hmm. Right. So this is a great, great book just to get some ideas. Of course, Yeti, I see very popular brand, very cool yeah. stuff. So where, where can people, th- this is on your website is the best this place. Is, to yes. get this? On our website. And we'll also, also share links to this on our social pages. Mm-hmm. Excellent. You can find it anywhere you try to find C-Ray. Awesome. 
All right. So the next thing I saw on the list is holiday watch parties. That's right. Yeah. What kind of watch parties are we talking about here? So, of course, during the holiday season, we want to still bring people together, albeit virtually this in this 2021 year. Um, mm -hmm. So our goal is to kind of bring that holiday cheer to people on our Facebook page every Tuesday of the month of December with okay. um, different interactions with our partners. Um, so you mentioned um, Kenyan. We have a, a really fun special with them where we'll be doing a cooking special and preparing um, you know, a meal together and our video followers can follow along um, live from that video footage. We'll also have a couple other great ones, um, a wine tasting. We have um, Blue Chair Bay Rum, kind of a, a cocktail experience, making a holiday cocktail. And then yep. finally on December 22nd, um, you know, a little a little caroling with um, with the singer um, Leah Ray Schaefer. So it should be should be a lot of fun. Oh, cool. Yeah, fun way to bring people together um, and kind of bring a little holiday cheer to the to the community. That's awesome. awesome. So the best place really for people to find those probably on Facebook. Yes. So we'll be right. live streaming all that on Facebook. Um, but if anyone is interested in participating, we would encourage you to kind of follow along with us in advance or sign up for our emails. Um, we'll be like, for example, for the cooking with Kenyan girls, um, we'll be posting ingredients that you can buy in advance and actually join us to, to do oh, the cute. cooking special. So um, sign up in advance and follow along and participate. Oh, that's, that's a lot of fun. All right. Okay. So that's, we've got the holiday gift guide. We've got mm -hmm. watch parties. And then yeah. let's hear more about this this photo contest because I hear there are giveaways involved with this. There are giveaways involved. You're correct. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, we get just, just the most amazing pictures. People are, you know, tagging us on Instagram or sending us pictures of them enjoying time on the water with their boat. We got so many fantastic pictures from our um, from our fans and from our owners in the summer during our Sea Race Summer Contest. So the goal is to mm -hmm. do something similar, but to really make it holiday themed. So you know, if you're out getting your sea break ready for the holidays. Maybe you're lighting it up. Maybe you're out on a, you know, out on the boat in a Santa hat, take a picture, send it to us. We'd love to see it. Maybe your boat is put away for the winter. That's okay too. You know, send a mm -hmm. picture um, of you and your family enjoying the holidays and you can certainly enter with that. And what we're doing is we will select one winner um, for each day leading up to Christmas in December. Wow. So December 1st through 25th. We'll have okay. a winner and we will announce prizes. Excellent. So Perfect. people could start submitting their photos now. That's right. Yeah. So definitely encourage you to take a look at our um, website. You really just upload a picture in our website directly, input your personal information, and mm -hmm. you're good to go. Okay. All right. I have a, a, a couple nice CRA, uh, like long sleeve shirts. You might catch <laughs> yeah. me tagging myself uh, trying to scoop <laughs> some of those prizes. Please do. <laughs> Yeah, please do. We got 25 different prizes. Um, a lot of them will kind of tie into the Fever gift guide that you saw. So we'll have okay. things like an ornament, um, a tumbler from Yeti, um, and some nice. other surprises from some of the partners. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. And it's uh, it's just uh, it's really cool to see things like this taking place and and just letting people know that hey, you know, getting out on the water is the best thing you can be doing this holiday season. If you live in the south, if you live in the north, you know, there's a lot to be dreaming about for 2021 <laughs> and uh, getting back out on the water. So, um, absolutely love it. And you make it really easy too. I mean, you know, it's easy to upload the photos. You have the holiday gift guide right there, all things in one place. So, That's well right. done. Kudos to you guys for that one. It should be fun. Awesome. All right. So with with the photo contest, yes. is it to officially qualify for for prizes? Is the primary way you're you're accepting submissions is through the website? You need to go to the website and upload a photo. Yes, great call. Out. Okay. Um, so please do it directly through our website. Make sure you give us the contact information. Um, we'll reach out to winners directly to let them know that they've won, and then we'll you know get them their prize and of course feature their great images on our social channels, which um, mm -hmm. we love to do. Um, the important thing to note there is that we will be accepting our submissions from you guys until the 11th of December. So between okay. now and then, you know, submit your pictures and we can't wait to see them. Awesome. All right. Well, cool. we'll have to make sure our, our followers know that that is an option. Uh, win some more C-Ray swag and yeah. participate in a fun campaign. So That's what cool. is your favorite item in this whole prize pack uh, holiday gift guide situation? Do you have a favorite? Oh, you know, I love a couple things I love. I love our um, season's greeting ornament. Just fun to kind of bring that theory 
branding to, to the Christmas tree and I'm <laughs> Love a big, it. Big, big sucker for the Yeti tumblers. I'm always uh -huh. drinking coffee or drinks on the go. So yep. I feel like you can yep. never go wrong with those. I've got mine right here. <laughs> oh, there you go. They're the best. They're fancier now. There are a lot of colors and they've got like a nice mm -hmm. texture. This is an old school, like tin one, but the tried okay. and true. The, the original. tried and true. Yep. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I use it. I use it all the time. Coffee, you know, ice water, that special cocktail, <laughs> whatever temperature you need to keep your drink. So those are definitely great gifts. They For are. Sure. All right. Well, we're, we're, we're definitely looking to see uh, what's coming up next from C-Ray. I know that there are some big things in the works, some some new launches for 2021, mm -hmm. which is right around the corner, which is yeah. crazy to, uh, to even believe. Um, right. So um, on social media, I know uh, C-Ray's everywhere, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, you're even on LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. yes. So followers uh, that want to connect with you can and you know pick your favorite social media platform, find C Ray on there, follow them, tag them in your posts. Uh, I know that they do a great job on social and will interact with you back as well, which is kind of fun. Always yeah, nice yeah. to get that from the brand you follow. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. Well, Kelly, any more questions for, from you? Uh, I'm just, uh, now that I'm on C Ray's website here, I'm going to look around for my next boat. And that's usually the way it goes <laughs> with uh, talking to the manufacturers and saying, uh, seeing all these really cool options here. So be sure to check out CRA.com, not only for the holiday gift guide and the cool uh, photo contest, but of course, to see the entire lineup of C Ray, bo mm -hmm. C -Ray boats um, and, uh, and to just check out all the latest models. That's the best way to do it. And of course, stop that's by it. your local Marine Max to see them in person. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, one of oh. Kelly's favorite things is that build a boat feature. Which I uh, he oh, like. Yeah. He, he's Sorry. probably playing with it right now. Yeah, <laughs> I, I can even. Uh, yeah, there we go. So build a boat here. Build. You can of course build your Sea Ray on their website. So if you're looking for a Sundancer SLX, SDX, SPX, you got them all right here, and uh, just look through. And of course, you know, I think there's some pretty good gifts right here. A, a new Sundancer <laughs> or a SLX for. Uh, That's kind of gift. <laughs> right. <Yeah. laughs> Awesome. Well, All thank right. you very much, Caroline. We appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. Any other final you. thoughts from you? Um, no, just don't forget to enter any pictures to be part of the contest before December 11th and sign up for our emails to get, um, to get, you know, the latest information for these watch parties. Awesome. Excellent. Cool. Thanks. All right. Well, thank, thank you so much for joining us today. Have an yeah, excellent thank Thanksgiving and, and we'll hopefully see you in person at an event sometime soon. Yeah, absolutely. Season's greetings and um, happy holidays. Thanks, guys. All right. Okay. Thank you, right. Caroline. Have a great Bye. day. See ya. That was awesome. Ooh, I, I'm, I'm looking into that virtual cocktail hour with Blue Chair Bay Rum. Hey, I, I got met I, guys at, I, I, I got connections at Blue Chair. I mean, we were at a, a Marine Max event one time and Blue Chair was sponsoring and uh, there's a few guys and uh, uh, and they were just awesome. They had it all right there. They had the cool cups. I think they even had this cool like drink module thing that you could take <laughs> snips of the blue chair out of really cool stuff though that team at blue chair bay it's a great product have you have you tried any of the blue blue chair bay rum i product? have and it is uh it is delicious so if you're looking for the tropical cocktails even if you're mm -hmm. up in again minnesota chicago wherever you might be at in the, the winter time and it's just you know blizzard out there you can always <laughs> rely on a good blue chair bay uh cocktail or and and just think about the days of tropical sunshine <laughs> right lisa yes yes uh hard hard for us to imagine here in florida right <laughs> hey it gets a little cold right i mean it gets wink wink silly. yeah all right awesome. all right let's switch gears here and get okay. on into our social update what's landon up to i need to know and, and he's gonna tell us here shortly hey landon. right in the middle there too hey landon how's it going how you doing sir not too shabby how are you guys doing Pretty good. good. Trying to, trying to I, stay I, warm I'm for the holidays here. Trying to stay warm. Yeah. <laughs> As we're in Florida and it's, you know, dipping to 65 and we're yep. all like, oh, you know, I'm from Indiana and I'm already in fully immersed into the Florida like body temperature because my neighbors are in t-shirts yep. and shorts and I'm huddled up now. And I'm like, what is happening? This it is goes so quick. backward. It, it I, really does. It's incredible. I remember it's it. Right when I like I moved down, like the first week, I saw this woman. It was like probably sixty-seven degrees. She had earmuffs on, like these, <laughs> they're actual earmuffs, and it was like sixty-seven. And I'm like, yes. man, coming from uh, the Midwest, uh, it's uh, it's a different world up there. That's for sure. 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, for this social update, I yep. didn't really have any, you know, normally I come here with really exciting marine life videos and stuff like that. <laughs> but something equally exciting to me is talking about how we can protect the environment and protect those marine life animals. Yes. Sure. Um, so w one of the um, companies that uh, Marine Max partners with is Four Ocean. So um, Four Ocean offers um, a number of just kind of cool bracelets and T-shirts and, and things of that nature. And what they do is essentially they go out to Haiti, they go out to Bali, they go out to South Florida, you know, even within the States. Mm -hmm. And they do a lot of beach cleanups. Uh, their mission is to clean up the plastic out of our oceans, which is become an incredible problem and issue, uh, yeah. you know, as the the world has become such a global, you know, phenomenon with plastics and shipping yeah. and things happening. And so it's, I think 4Ocean is such a cool uh, organization that really focuses on let's, let's clean up all the trash and junk that's getting thrown into the ocean, into the waterways, and it's yep. affecting our marine life, killing our mm -hmm. turtles and sharks and everything else. Um, so this is uh this is my fun social kind of segment for today is I know you you brought up a number of really good um, gift ideas for boaters mm -hmm. and a lot of those have functional purposes but actually Four Ocean has some really good looking um, bracelets I actually am always wearing this awesome mm -hmm. I, I haven't taken it off since I put it on almost a year ago mm -hmm. um, maybe that's bad I don't know but um, <laughs> got staying power yeah right. Essentially, essentially everything that you buy from Four Ocean, every single product that you buy helps clean up a pound of plastic of mm -hmm. trash out sure. of the ocean. So, a right. little tiny bracelet right here. That's that's a pound right there. Well, and and what is that made out of? It's it's made out of ninety percent, uh, at least ninety percent recycled material from what they gather out of the ocean. That's so, astonishing. And we're on their website right now. So if uh, if you, you guys want to check out exactly what Land Landon, show it off again for the fine folks at home. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll be the Vanna White for this episode, you know, showing <laughs> off my fine bracelet here. But um, yep. so they have different styles of bracelets. Um, they they all go to the same thing. It's all going towards cleaning up at least a pound um, every mm -hmm. for every product that you buy. But they all kind mm -hmm. of mean something different. So right. right there you see a pink one. And that's that's for flamingo awareness because flamingos um, can actually, you know, they're they're in waterways uh, and yeah. they can actually be affected by the plastic as well. So that's to bring yeah. awareness to the fact that like this helps flamingos out and Interesting. Mm -hmm. there's green ones for turtles because turtles are affected by this too. Oh yeah. So kind of, I, I think everybody's got their favorite, maybe marine life animal. And I think they'd probably be represented on boat four ocean with these bracelets. Lisa, didn't I, uh, I think we were at the Fort Lauderdale boat show last year, maybe Miami. And I was like, do you guys have squid? And then he was like, unfortunately, no, but we're working on it or something. And I was like, yeah, yes. <laughs> I want a squid one. Why squid, Kelly? Uh, cephalopods are very interesting creatures. And yeah. They're very intelligent and you don't see them too often because they're very, you know, a lot of times down really deep, um, but just interesting. But yeah, I, it's pretty cool, though. Like they have a bunch of different animals you can get. I think there's a lot mm -hmm. of birds and fish and, and all that stuff. Uh, so. Yeah, it's like a collector's I, item. I'm just fascinated at the word cephalopod that you had. So <laughs> that's that's all I'm thinking about right now. That's, that's is the uh, the scientific name for the giant squid, uh, I believe. So somebody yeah. watches the Discovery Channel. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> or so ten thousand leagues under the sea, or twenty thousand leagues under the sea, maybe. Too. There you go. So no. pers personally, I've I've given my sister and brothers um, four ocean bracelets because I think it's just such a neat, mm -hmm. uh, neat product with a neat cause. So um, if you're interested, I think that it'd make for a really cool um, gift for boaters. No, that's great. And, uh, yeah. you know, it's always great to talk to the team at four ocean. They're already they're always doing some really cool things. It kind of reminds me of our conversation last week, too, in regards to just cleaning up uh, the waste yep. that falls into the waterways. Uh uh, with the team at Pelican Ops. So yeah, yeah, check them out for Ocean. Uh, there's a lot of cool things and, um, you know, it's stylish, but it's also going for a good cause of, of cleaning up the, the the place that we all love and go boating. Right. It, yeah. So and the reason, I, the reason I brought it up is top of mind. I, I was scrolling through Instagram and we follow their Instagram page and one of their photos popped up and I was like, oh, this is great. So they, they yeah. do a lot of things on Facebook and Instagram where they show off these beaches before and after photos of what yeah. they look like. It's incredible what they look like before in some places. I mean, just yep. the entire beachfront 
gets gets wiped with trash and it's it's pretty sickening but yeah now they have a new iphone case yeah that's a new product that they just rolled out um their iphone cases are made of again recycled material recycled? from their wow. from the junk that they pull up so um, wow. that's pretty neat they're gonna work on more iphone models yeah i just so. popped it up all the brand new iphone models are in there coming soon for some of them and nice. uh, you know cleanup gear that's cool so not only can you just get some stylish things but also if you want to go help out they also have uh you know some some gloves a, a bag things like that that you can get out wow. there and get that's done. a and that's an interesting point you bring up because typically in times past they do a lot of not only do they sell these products and that's one of the number one ways that they make money to do what they do mm -hmm. um, but they also put on a lot of events even locally in uh, st pete and clearwater and stuff like that we've we've seen four ocean cleanup events um so i do wonder kind of how they're managing that right now with the covid situation and how they're you know, yeah. probably their events are having to scale back a little bit. But, um, you know, once guys, once things get back to normal, make sure you check out some of the four ocean cleanup events mm -hmm. because it's something really simple and easy and fun to do. Yep. Yeah. Well, I spend a lot of time on the beach playing beach volleyball. And that's one of the things that always amazes me is like, we're not even down by the water and we can pull up some, some trash that's just been, you know, that people can actually hurt themselves on mm -hmm. a lot of things are sharp. So at the end of every day, we always have like a tiny little trash pile by one of our volleyball poles and we do a little bit of cleanup. But I mean, Four Ocean takes it one step further and they're not just throwing it away. They're recycling it into cool products that people can buy. It's a great cyclical cycle that they have going on where, you know, you buy something that was, you know, previously floating in your your backyard and your in your favorite watering hole. Yep. Good yeah, we call, Landon. Yeah, I, I think as a society, we really got to keep focusing on the conversation of of how, you know, negative this this impacts the environment and stuff. So if we're, we're at the beach when we're playing beach volleyball and we see somebody throw out their, you know, plastic bottle, we need to publicly shame them, you know, cowbell, <laughs> Game of Thrones style, do something. But we got to we got to make sure that, you know, we we prevent it from happening in the first mm -hmm. place so that something like four ocean doesn't even have to exist. Right. Well, good call. Thank you for sharing and reminding people that that is an option for holiday gifts this yeah, season. Sure. Um, and Kelly, I think we've got, we've got something cool from you today in our social update. Is that true? I think that that's a good way of wrapping up the episode here is, uh, oh. we, we got something from the entire team at Marine Max, uh, considering it's, uh, it's, a, a time of thanks from uh, from all of us to all of you out there for Marine Max. And uh, so anything else before anybody, uh, before we go here, Landon, you got anything else, Lisa, before we get this? No, just uh, thanks to Caroline English from Sea Ray. She shared a lot of good stuff that's available from their team as well. Uh, so get online, follow them, make sure to follow us. Yeah. And uh, I'd love, I, I can't wait to see this. Okay. Landon, what about you, sir? I've, I've got nothing. Everybody have a fantastic Thanksgiving. Yeah. All right. Yes. And from everybody here at Marine Max to all of you out there, uh, we wish you a happy Thanksgiving and have a great holiday season. And we're just going to kick off a cool little video from, uh, from our team. So thanks, guys. We'll see you next right. time. Hello. My name is Brett McGill, CEO and president here at Marine Max. You know, it's been a really interesting year out there this year and it's been pretty tough on a lot of people. But one thing it's reminded me of is that boating is one of those great recreations that you can escape the everyday stresses of life and get out on the water, enjoy time with your family and friends, socially distance and safe. We are very thankful to all of our team members here at Marine Max who've spent a lot of time this past season supporting all of you out there to make sure you enjoy time on the water. Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Boston. Gobble, gobble. <laughs> From our family at Marine Max in beautiful Pompano Beach, Florida, to yours, we wish you a very Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Clearwater. From Marine Max Lake Wiley, Happy, Happy Thanksgiving! Thanksgiving! From everyone here at Marine Max Danvers, we wish you a Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Jacksonville Beach. Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Orlando. On behalf of Marine Max Orlando, we would like to thank all of our customers for a fantastic year and wish you all a happy Thanksgiving. On behalf of Marine Max of Charleston, happy Thanksgiving. From the crew of Marine Max Huntington, we wish you a Merry Christmas.
we want to wish you and your family a happy Thanksgiving! From our family at Marine Max, in beautiful Palm Beach, Florida, yours, we wish you a very happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Houston! Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Houston! All of us here at Marine Max Wrightsville Beach want to wish you and your family Happy Thanksgiving! From the team at Marine Max in Rogers, Minnesota Happy Thanksgiving! From our whole team here at Marine Max Sail and Ski, we're wishing you Happy Thanksgiving! From everyone at, at Marine Max Sail and Ski in San Antonio, we would all like to wish you a Happy, Happy Thanksgiving! Thanksgiving. This Thanksgiving, we are truly thankful for you and for letting us help keep you out on the water. From our family here at Marine Max St. Petersburg, we want to say, Happy Thanksgiving! The team at Marine Max Venice would like to wish all of our friends a very happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving from Marine Max Maryland. From all of us at Marine Max Dallas, Happy Thanksgiving! From our family here at Marine Max Coco, Happy Thanksgiving! From all of us at Marine Max Pensacola, Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving! From everyone at Marine Max Island Marine in Ocean View, New Jersey, Happy Thanksgiving! Hi, I'm Dean from Brick, New Jersey. Everybody, Happy Thanksgiving and Happy Holidays! Happy, Happy Thanksgiving! Thanksgiving. On behalf of everyone here at Marine Max, we would like to thank you for your business. And we hope you have a great holiday season. And we'll see you out on the water. We hope you enjoyed this episode of From the Helm Boating Broadcast. To keep up with the latest news and notes in the world of boats, be sure to follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and wherever podcasts can be heard. Until next time, we'll see you out on the water.